generations of kids come through and uh, from all parts of the community we've had kids from housing projects and with no resources whatsoever and we've had kids that have come from affluent families and it's a great place to blend uh, uh, different groups and uh, let the kids mix and experience life uh, at the Boys and Girls Club and providing opportunities for them to experience things that they normally wouldn't get to uh, in their home life. So I was actually told that since I'm learning this now, I'm going to be ahead of everyone in um, high school. Mm -hmm. After 43 years of full-time work with the Boys and Girls Club, I started in 1979 full-time, right when I graduated from University of the Ozarks and worked in Clarksville three years in the last 40 years here in Fort Smith. I'm just grateful for all the sponsors and volunteers over the year. We've had a very strong board of directors that have financially supported the club and, and uh, Alumni and Friends Association and a great staff and, and uh, great kids to work with over the years. And then the Oh, do it again. Give me that presentation again. Leprechaun. Well, I turned 66 in October, and um, I've had my season at the club, and um, there's uh, exciting things on the horizon uh, with the building of the new facility here at the Jeffrey uh, property, and uh, in 2028, we will be celebrating 100 years. It'll be our 100th anniversary. The club started in 1928. So uh, a lot of exciting things happening. Uh, Beth Presley, the new executive director, has lots of experience in fundraising. She's been involved with the Chamber and the United Way and other charities and the college and the schools. So she's going to step in and do a great job, take, take the club to new heights, I think. And one thing I think is really impressive about our organization, we've had four different individuals that have served on the board of directors for 50 years or longer. There we go. Don't worry. Two will be next. Two will be next. Watch it. Watch the swing. All right. I had a board member that's making a presentation. He asked me if I could write down for him notable people that have been members at the Boys and Girls Club in, here in Fort Smith. U.S. Senator John Bozeman was a member. Governor Asa Hutchinson used to be a volunteer soccer coach here. State Senator-elect Jim Petty, Dr. Lee Johnson and Jay Richardson, State Representative Rick Nagel, who's on the Board of Regents at OU, was a Youth of the Year. Tommy Boyer, Wayne Allen, TV anchor Elise Eady, who was runner-up Miss America, country music star Toby Keith, Robert Young, NBA players Isaiah Joe, Jalen Williams, former NBA players Jim King, Ron Brewer, Jaleel Okafor, current NFL players Trey Norwood and Keandre Thomas of the Packers, Gus Balzon, National Coach of the Year. I mean, there's tons of people. It's amazing that have gone through the clubs. providing hope and opportunity and a safe haven for them to go.